Um, you mentioned there drag hunting, and why can we not be actively supporting that whole you know, nature of drag hunting and leave the live pursuit of animals who usually end up being pulled apart by whatever animal is chasing them and leave that to, to something else, to, to bygone days, because that's where it belongs. Thank Minister. you. The final reply, Minister. Well, first of all, you know, I, I'm not sure it's true to say that usually an animal gets pulled apart. Um, the fox normally escapes from my, from my um, experience of, um, of hunting. Not that I have a huge amount of experience of it, but for any, um, um, any time I have had, have, um, had experience, I've, I've never seen a fox being being pulled apart, but I'm sure it happens, but, and I'm not saying it doesn't. Um, look, um, as I said before, my, um, uh, the decisions we've made on this from a policy perspective is to try and get a balance um, that allows people who, are, uh, who derive a huge amount of enjoyment out of hunting, also farmers who want foxes uh, hunted off their land um, 